Greetings traders out there in trader land. My name's Dez here at Grok Trade, senior analyst and mentor. And it is Wednesday, August 3rd, 2011. And for all you day traders out there, <laughs> take a big swig of Maalox or take some Tom's Watt, a violent and turbulent day we had today in the markets. The Dow ended up, believe it or not, 0.25%. The S&P up half a percent. NASDAQ up almost 1%. Russell's knocking at that door up also. Banks up 1.2%. A 6% drop in volatility index, still at 23. Gold slightly down, silver slightly down, uh, or silver slightly up but gold uh, started dropping a bit but gold has been hitting all-time highs it seems like the last few days and US dollar down a half a percent helping the markets go bullish and crude oil down quite a bit too down one and a half percent we're down around ninety one dollars on crude oil transportation index did exceptionally well giving support to the Dow and check this out right out of the gates we opened up, started heading up. I loaded up on some longs, and all of a sudden, man, we just do an about face. All the market internals started going south, so I hedged myself. And as soon as we broke this low right there, I was big time short. We'll go down, 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 down. Then we did a touch and go, like almost a V bottom formation. Let me show you the this. 15 minute chart on the SP. We drop, 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 boom, and never looked back. No double bottom. No head inverted head and shoulders, no triple bottom. It was just a boom up, a little pullback and rally. Do a five minute chart, you can see it here. Boom. And you could almost on a five minute chart call it inverted head and shoulders. Yeah, and then it just started heading back up. But back to the daily. Uh, we sustained some significant damage here on this drop. Yesterday's drop in breaking of a major trend line, it, it does not surprise me that we had such a major day. It was like Dow was at 265 points or so. doesn't surprise me because it did break that major support line. Obviously, you had volume increase on that. And today, um, here we are. We go and make this new low lower high lower low we come back up and we hammer out and we hammer out closing right around this 1260 mark which is really important that we got above or right at that whole number not a below it but we got above our 1257 area that we've been watching so closely so that's good to see but the here's the big picture the big picture is this markets are in significant trouble although I am looking forward to some sort of bounce here I do see that coming. It looks like we're trying to hammer out a bottom, but we're in a lot of trouble. If I go here to the weekly, we broke this. So the only way to heal this weekly chart is if the markets rally back in the next two days, getting above 1300. If it doesn't do that, we have a confirmed breaking of a trend line on the weekly chart. Here on the monthly, doesn't surprise me that we come right back up bouncing higher because th this support line is still intact. All right. So will tomorrow be an update? Not necessarily. Let me share with you why. See the hammer down here after an extended down leg here? This is a, a huge down leg. That goes back several years last time we've seen such a down leg. We have a hammer. A lot of people are expecting a bounce here. But watch this. If you look for other significant hammers, you know, big, big hammers like this. I mean, I'm just going back in time here. Let's see if I can find a couple major bottom hammers like this one right here. All right. So big drop, big drop, big drop, big drop. Hammer, long shadow, next day, bearish. Do you see this? Popped up like it was going to be bullish, bearish. And then it rallies higher. How about this? Big drop, big hammer, big lower shadow. We should go bullish. Nope. Boom. Bearish next day. And then it starts to run up. Um, how about this one? We go down, 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 down. Up. Big hammer. Next day. Bearish. Then it runs up. See that? So uh, you can just go back and see this. A lot of times after hammers, you'll get some uh, 
Yeah, so I, there's no no other huge hammer jumping out at me right now. So there it is. Hey, if you want to join me tonight, I'm doing a free online class at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's the 101 Trading Foundations course at 6 p.m. Pacific. All you have to do is click on calendar. Go to freeonlinetradingeducation.com. Just go to the website, click on calendar, and today, August 3rd, just click on that link, get registered. Maybe you can't join us tonight. That's fine, but if you register, I will send you a video of it, and you can watch it at your own leisure. And at the tail end of that, I'll be talking about the mentorship program and tell you all the ins and outs on that. So there you have it. Take care and very safe trading to you. Make sure you share our website and this video with all your trading friends.